Yo, what is up YouTube? Trilog here and today I'm going to be showing you guys an easier method to bypass the update required message that Roblox has added to all of UWP, which is the Microsoft version of Roblox. They did this to stop exploiters from not having Bifron. And I had a method out recently called the Fiddler method, where you would go in and edit your HTTP and add a rule that auto responds, all that, ton of methods. You can go ahead and check that out in the description if you wanna use that method. Um, but right now I have a very easy method for you guys and I'm gonna basically show you guys how to do it. It's very easy and it takes like a couple steps. And yeah, we're just gonna jump right into it. So first things first, you're gonna press your Windows key and you're gonna go ahead and type security. And whenever Windows security pops up, you wanna open it. And you're gonna to wanna to go to virus and threat, go to manage settings, and make sure this is off. If this is off, it's gonna work. If it's on, it's not going to. So make sure real-time protection is off. So you can X that out. Next, all you're gonna to wanna to do is just go to settings. So here we are, here's in settings. And in settings, you're gonna to go to, it is update and security, which is right here. And then you're going to go down to for developers and this is very important make sure developer mode is on turn on this right here this first one the other ones you can leave off it doesn't matter just make sure that developer mode is on now you can go ahead and x that out as well and then i'm going to go ahead and leave the link for this um the link for this file that you're going to need i'm going to go ahead and drag it on the screen so there's going to be this file here it's going to be first link in the description and you're just going to click fluxer fluster.exe just click it it'll download and yeah that's what you're going to need and after it downloads you're going to have it just like you could see here it's on my desktop and we're going to go ahead and just double click it and then you're going to be prompted with this windows protected your pc don't worry about this all you got to do is press more info and then press run anyway and then once it runs, you're going to see this right here. It's going to prepare everything for the setup. It's going to run through this quick setup dialog. And then once it's done, then I'll go ahead and show you how it works. I'm going to go ahead and speed this up and I'll be right back. Alrighty guys, I am back. And as you can see, it auto closed fluster, which is what it's supposed to do now all you're gonna have to do is press your windows key and then when you're in your windows key you're gonna search fluster i'll go ahead and pull up a uh, like a screenshot because i'm not sharing that screen so i'll screenshot that and i'll put it up on screen now so as you guys can see there's an app called fluster and whenever you see that app you're just gonna click it and it'll open up roblox here as you can see, it's going to be called Fluster, and it's going to open it up, and it's not going to have any of the update required messages. Now, I'm going to go ahead and log in so I can show you guys that it is working. So let me go ahead and log in here. <clears throat> Enter my password. Ooh, I just messed up my password. All right, there we go. And I'm going to go ahead and actually, as you can see, we got a retry message, but if you click retry, it'll work. So if you get that, just press retry. And then we're going to go ahead and open up Task Manager here. And as you can see, if we go into Fluster, which is right here, you can see it's running 32 bit. That means it is working. Now we can go ahead and test this out. We can join Blade Ball if we want to test it out. And you're going to want to use a working executor right now. The only working executor is Vega X, at least for me. So go ahead and download Vega X if you want, or you can download a different executor. But we're gonna go ahead and inject so I can show you guys that this is working. And while we go ahead and let it inject, I'm gonna go ahead and grab my script, link in the description if you guys want that script as well for Blade Ball and a ton of other games. And we're gonna go ahead and execute it. And as you can see guys, the script loads up perfect. It's working in this version of Roblox, which is which is, what is it, Fluster. So if you guys did enjoy this quick tutorial, make sure to like and subscribe because it helps me out a ton. And as always, guys, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.